And so he had been misdiagnosed from birth okay. to that point. Uh, and that was, uh, he was diagnosed with cerebral palsy and mild retardation. But that's going back all the way to 1990, so 26 years ago, they didn't really have all this technology. He had gone from being a floppy baby with uh, uh, no appetite to all of a sudden he went to this other extreme. And this extreme was he was eating like everything. And one day I saw him getting some food out of the garbage can. And I say, something is wrong. We would have never known anything about Prader Willie syndrome because nobody knew about it. And then we live in an area that's, that still to this date is behind medically than some of the other metropolitan areas. And so when he first got the diagnosis, the only way that he was diagnosed was there was a, neuro, a neurologist that had followed him from birth. So I came across this, this picture one day and it caught my attention and the, uh, it re the characteristics resembled Darian's features. And so she goes and she flips and she comes to this and it says, Prater Willie syndrome. She said, I don't know anything about this syndrome, but I think this might be. And the reason, you know, of course it tells some of the characteristics. You can see the, the features, the physical features, they resembled him. And then as she read the things to us, those are some of the symptoms that we begin to see. And we're like, what is this? And she says, nobody knows, it's rare. At that point it was one in 15,000. 